Let's try another measurement question. Here we're going to find the distance between two points on this imperial ruler. And this ruler happens to have more teeth. There are 16 teeth per inch. We have point A here, and we'll say we have point B here. What's the distance between A and B? So we can see there's more teeth here. If we count, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight teeth takes us halfway from two inches towards three inches. And of course, times two is going to be 16. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 teeth per inch. So the key here is we know we have 16 teeth here. I'm going to count now here one, two, three, four. So we have four additional teeth here. And then here we have almost 16. We have one, two less than 16. So we know that this here is 14 because all the teeth for this inch would be 16 and one, two less would be 14. I'm counting backwards because it's faster and there's less chance of mistake. So 16 plus 14 is 30. 30 plus 4 is 34. So the, there's a total of 34 teeth. Each teeth is 1 16th of an inch. Because it takes 16 teeth to make 1 inch, each tooth is 1 16th of an inch. So we multiply this 34 times the width of each tooth and what we get here is numerator times numerator is 34 and denominator times denominator 1 times 16 is 16 and of course we can re reduce this we get dividing top and bottom by 2 17 over 8 inches or you can even say the denominator fits into the numerator two times so we have two inches and we get that eight times two is 16 17 minus one is 16 and this is going to be one eighth this here is a mixed fraction let's try one more let's pick this point over here we we'll use the color red this here is our B value, and we'll choose an A value that's pretty far, all the way over here. Can we find this distance? And we know that this here is going to be 16 teeth, and this here is going to be another 16 teeth, because when we count, these teeth are quite small, and generally, these imperial rulers in inches comes in 8 or 16 teeth per inch. And then here, we're almost another 16 inches, but we're going to be 1, 2, 3 short. 16 minus 3 is 13. So I'm going to say from here to here is going to be 13 teeth. And this here is the halfway point. So a half an inch is going to be 8 teeth. So adding carefully, we have total number of teeth from A to B. What we have here is we have 8 plus 16 plus 16 plus 13, which is equals to 53 teeth in total. So we know that each tooth is going to be 1 16th of an inch. So what we get here is a distance of 53 over 16, which is the same as 3 inches and 5 16th. We can confirm this by multiplying 3 times 16 plus 5 as the numerator, and the denominator stays the same. So for these questions, just be careful. Are there 16 teeth per inch, or are there 8? and just count carefully, making sure that you know what parts you're adding.